The annual lecture of the Maritime Reporters Association of Nigeria themed Maritime Security, Emerging Threats and Actionable Steps. Stakeholders expressed with concern the security level burden in the Nigerian port, stating that Nigerian government have so much to do to curb the poorest state of waterways. Today's seminar is very, very apt. It is the news broadcaster of maritime coming together, all of them coming together to provide a platform for experts, stakeholders to discuss a germane topic, maritime security in our waters. So they are the people who broadcast the news, who vent the activities within the maritime industry. And for them to come together to put up this platform for people to come and open their mind. It is eye-opener even for me, who is practicing. I've learned a lot today. The insecurity in the port is order of the day where the government will need to be blamed as a result of not uh, empowering the security agents that are supposed to manage the affairs of security in the port. You could imagine when you have a marine police, hardly you see them with uh, boats, they don't have boats for them to patrol, uh, go to area B or even within the port here, there's no facilities uh, for them to, 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 to work. How do you expect the security to, uh, to be managed? So we, we should use this middle to tell the Inspector General of Police, the Nigeria Port Authority, uh, all the relevant stakeholders, that is to encourage all the security agents within the port. President of Maran, Godfrey Bivere, noted that there is no better time to discuss the German issue other than now. Um, insecurity is something that uh, that it, uh, does not only affect uh, the individual operators in the industry, but also the nation and especially the nation's economy. So it is very, very important that uh, uh, that it is dealt with to curb the the loss that the uh, the industry is uh, uh, that the that the economy is uh, uh, getting from uh, for such insecurity. Being the port and flag state administration, they can easily set up a situation whereby they insist that all vessels coming to Nigeria must give a ship entry notice. I know NPA gives it for vessels coming to port. But before a vessel leaves anchor at any foreign port and its end destination is Nigeria, they must issue a ship entry notice which can be done online, whereby it gives details of every single information on the vessel. Until the master approves that ship entry notice, that vessel cannot be found. The event also has panel section where experts extract the Nigerian ports and the blue economy. Adobe Obiechina, NTA News.